go to manage select design options and add new option set this is like a group of your options here you have three options in one group you have primary option and let's rename this group to mine house here you have three options in this group okay let's select the elements that you want to add to your design options select those elements and add to three options in the main house group okay let's add them now duplicate the views let's rename this one to option one let's duplicate the group let's rename this to option two and let's duplicate one more time and rename this to option three now you have three views let's go up to the option one and if you try to select those elements you cannot select them if you want to edit them you have to select the options that you made select option one and now you can edit those elements select option two or option three set this to option one and go to visibility graphic override design option panel and set the option one as primary to this view now go to another view with option two let's go to visibility graphic overrides and select option two everything is grayed out because you are in option one set this to option two and now you can edit those elements let's go to next view level one option three and here also go to visibility graphic overrides and design options and set option three as primary option to this view also everything is grayed out because you're in option two select main model select pick to edit and select any element in this option three let's say this wall now you can edit this option let's move the walls down and add more walls to this option let's say one wall here one wall here door here there let's add another window let's say here and there now if you select option two everything is grayed out because in visibility graphics override this view option three is primary design option for this view let's go to view with option one pick to edit select elements and now you're in option one now let's go to another view with option two pick to edit pick elements and now you're in option two add wall here and there add another door here and here let's add another window let's say here and now go back to main model now you have option one option two and option three and now all you have to do is add them to the sheet let's make a new sheet let's add option two option one and option three and now you have three options on the same sheet and you can present them to the client what else can we do let's go to option two and add some room tags let's go to architecture add room tags add room tags to those rooms if you want to add rooms let's say if you select add room you see that the room cannot see the wall so what you need to do is pick to edit edit this option option two and now add the room to this option two now it sees the wall let's add room three and four what else can we do let's add another design group let's say for this wall right here what you want to do is go to design options new option set and let's rename this to the back wall okay add new option now you have two options in this option set back wall now select the back wall go to add to set and select back wall you can also add this to the main house but we want it in a separate set so we will add this to the set name back wall now let's go to view level one option one pick to edit pick the back wall and add let's say two windows 
here and there. Okay. Now, let's say we don't want to see this in the option one. Let's select option two as primary for this view. Okay. Now, go back to main model, go to level one, option two. Here you see those two windows, and I don't want to see them in this view also, so I'll select option two as primary for this view. And we have like wall without the windows, and in level one, option three, let's set this to option one. And in this view, we see wall with two windows. Now let's say you explore the design options and you want to keep the design option three and get rid of the all other versions, the old versions. Now let's go to design options and make option three as primary. And for the back wall, let's also set option two as primary because we like those windows. Okay, now let's go back to design options, select main house set. And if you accept primary, what does this do? It deletes all other options in this set and also the set itself and the views if you select them. Now accept primary for the back wall and do not select the last view because it will delete it. And now you're left with the last view and all the primary design versions that you choose to keep. Hope this helps. Have a great day and see you in the next video.